Hi everybody, here we are in the beautiful Night City in Cyberpunk 2077 and in this video I'm going to show you how to eliminate, well, or at least severely reduce the amount of screen tear you get on this game on PC by enabling V-Sync. So screen tear is normally when you're kind of looking around and the, the screen will literally get tears in it so that the, the um, objects in, that you're watching on the, in the game will, will not line up. You'll know it when you see it basically. Um, putting V-Sync on gets rid of most of it. You do end up with a little bit, but anyway, so in order to enable it, what you want to do is you want to go into the settings, and it's not where you think it would be. You think it would be in graphics, and I didn't know this for, for quite a while when I've been playing Cyberpunk on the PC. Um, it's actually in video, um, and then here you have V-Sync here, and what you can do is you can match it to the frame rate of your monitor so whatever your frame rate of your monitor is running at you'll want to want to set it so my frame my monitor is let me just check it running and see what it's this probably won't come up on your screen but i'll see it so my frame rate is well it's, it's capable of running at 120 hertz so i'm going to set it to 120 i'm going to apply that and then what should happen is the screen will get smoother um, and you won't see the tearing that you would see normally. Now it's worth playing around with this a little bit. You may well want to change the settings on your monitor as well. Um, for example, turn it down to say um, uh, 60 frames per second uh, in the in the settings, um, so you can sync it to that. But I found that although obviously I don't get 120 frames per second out of Cyberpunk, by setting the V-Sync on to 120. Um, and my monitor is, is outputting at 120 frames a second. Even if Cyberpunk isn't, it does mean it gets rid of most of the screen tearing. And the problem I have with screen tearing is that it, I think, it really ruins immersion. Screen tearing. Um, so, um, uh, so yeah. So that's how you do it. You just go into, go into the settings, not in graphics. Go into video. And then to match the V-Sync to your frame rate on your monitor, and you should find the game looks a lot smoother than it did before. Anyway, so there we go. Hopefully, you found that video useful. If you have, hit like, once you more, the same, press subscribe, and I will, of course, see you again soon.